way of my guy last night, <laughs> Zion <laughs> Williamson. Woo, your guy. But it's the, you know what? Well, I, I mean, he really, that is not bandwagon because he's been your guy so long that I call exactly. him your son. Exactly. That's my guy. I mean, Zion's been my guy since since he was dunking on people at, you know, the little Christian school down there in South Carolina. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? Okay. I mean, the little private school, whatever little school. I don't forget the little high school he went to. And, uh, look, like he lived in the district. Exactly. <laughs> but it's all good. But he had one heck of a game. I'm talking about the Pelicans and the Lakers, which was the first matchup from last night. Um, man, that game, I, for, okay, let's, let's be clear. Mm-hmm. If the Pelicans win that game, they, they they won't win the next the, the series that get they get into they just they, right exactly they, that team although there are a couple of players on there Trey Murphy some other some other guy there's some players on there but let's be honest C J McCollum I, he was walking around downtown Glenwood last night because <laughs> he definitely wasn't playing in New Orleans he wasn't in New Orleans last he, he wasn't there he was nowhere to be found I agree you know Brandon Ingram. I, I'm going to talk about that in a little detail a little bit later. But just looking in his eyes, either he was had the flu or sick or something. Something else. Who knows? Something. I'm like, whatever, whatever it was, basketball was not on his mind last night as well. Then Zion was just like, what? What y'all do? I'm, t- I'm so going to put you on put it on his shoulder. Like, so nobody's going to go with me? Nobody, nobody else wants to play? Mm-hmm. And then they went and found a little man. <laughs> <laughs> Alvarado. My guy. Two oh bro two God. look, two bum ankles out there running around doing what he had to do, but he did a good job. But they went down, of course. They came they made a little you know, a nice little run at the end. Came back, I think it was right before thirty. Like three maybe, minutes to go. Three minutes. Right, then it was like yeah. a minute, uh, maybe thirty seconds. It was like still a three four point game and they just didn't. Without Zion, because Zion went out at about three minutes. Yeah, yeah. That um, changed everything right With the muscle injury. But uh, let's get right to it. Let's find out what the status is from the head coach of um, the New Orleans Pelicans on Zion's um, injury. Head coach Willie Green, by the way. Right now, we know his his left leg. Uh, soreness and he's going to get some imaging on it tomorrow and we'll we'll figure out more. Um, that's the report that I got back. I haven't see, talked to him or anything like that, but we'll see how we feel. We'll see what happens tomorrow when we get the results back. You know if it was a knee or foot? Uh, I, I, I couldn't tell. I, I don't know if it was a knee, foot. Once tomorrow, I'm sure I'll have more of an update of, of what's going on with him. Uh, We're going to push you into telling us what's going on. I don't know about that explanation, Pam. <laughs> Well, he he don't know. He was he kept on coaching and to so he didn't know. Damn. <laughs> he don't want to tell you. Come on, I couldn't tell. I know you. I, I know, didn't even I know, ask. I, know. I didn't even ask any of the trainers right. that took him back. Right. But what'd you do? It was still time left on the clock. You asked somebody what's going on. This is post game. This post game. Mm-hmm. So nobody nobody told you. You didn't talk to him. <laughs> this is Zion. This is Zion Williamson on the New Orleans Pelicans. Just scored forty you, points. You are the head coach. You did not talk to your star player. Well, you know, I'm just gonna let him rest tonight. I'll call him in the morning. You did not <laughs> talk. If anyone on this whole in the whole arena talked to Zion, he did right. It should be his head coach. It should be. Yeah. All right, and I get a chance to talk to him. You just gonna lie to me in my face. <laughs> <laughs> yes. That's what just happened. Mm-hmm. Let's hear from Willie, uh, head coach Willie Green, as he talks about um, having to play the rest of the game without Zion. It was tough. It was tough to to see him go down. You know, we're all praying and hoping that he's okay, but he was battling. He was going. The team was was right there with him. So it, it's tough. We'll see what happens, and we'll go from there. Mm. It was so tough that you probably couldn't go to sleep without finding out <laughs> and talking to him because. I mean, I'm going to have to hear it later on in the show one more time, but mm-hmm. I don't know, Coach Green. Yeah, I haven't got a chance to talk to him yet. Uh, I think he's still in the building. I don't, I'm not sure. 
But it sure was tough without him. It was tough without him. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, he was really Bobby. Come on. Don't do us like that. That might be a bad sign. That's a horrible sign. That's a horrible. Which also tells me I don't see too many surprises. I mean, I saw you know, a few shocks, but mm-hmm. I think he's probably been battling whatever. I don't know if it's his foot. Because um, I think he had foot. One of, the, one of the time he's out, I think it was a foot surgery. Was that right, a Yeah. Yeah. I don't know if it was a surgery, but definitely a foot injury. It was a foot injury. Mm-hmm. So Probably a surgery, though. Yeah. But, then, you know, so you could t- I could tell. Because he kind of finished the play. Mm-hmm. Right? So he, he kind of finished the play. He was still there, but he was like, he, he was kind of, you know, wincing and grimacing a little bit. And he kind of said, come on, man, get me out. Yeah, he knew he couldn't go any further. Yeah, he knew. Whatever the problem was, he mm-hmm. knew. He was like, oh. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, he didn't grab anything. He didn't, like, yeah. grab his mm-hmm. knee yeah. or foot, so. Yeah, I've, I've seen people online. They talk about it was his Achilles and this and that. I said, no, 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 no. <laughs> Those, you reach for. Right. Because <laughs> oh. you, look, because it's like, it's like, a, there, there's not, it's, I've never seen one where nobody, with someone standing and saying, oh, it's kind of wiggling the foot. I wonder what that is. Right. No, those. You try He's to fix it. it. You try yeah. to fix it. Like, oh, wait, wait a minute. Mm-hmm. Let me let me try to fix That's this. That's true. But I don't know. What did you think last night, fam? What did you think overall about the game? I was. I mean, I was loving watching Zion do his thing. Yeah. Um. Lakers. Well, okay. Let's talk about the Lakers. Your Lakers. Let's talk about my Lakers. Let's go. <laughs> I know I was a little. You know, I, was, I wasn't quite on the bandwagon yesterday, but I'm all in. Did they impress you enough to think that they're going to give Denver any trouble? Yes. Really? I believe okay. the Los Angeles Lakers, if they play the way – see, a lot of people didn't really realize that AD was taking line at night off last night. Right? Mm-hmm. You know, like his lower back and yeah, know, whatever. Yeah. Which he said he'll be fine in a few days because they don't play more until Saturday, I think. If if LeBron LeBron has figured out – how to get the most out of those young, out of those players, mm-hmm. without him having to try to do everything. He he has figured he has figured out how to get those guys to step up, without him having to try to do everything, without them just standing around doing what the Pelicans were doing. Right, wait, just standing around to watching do everything. Yeah, they're right. just standing around watching. <laughs> like you're not gonna move, you're not gonna cut, you're not gonna. Th- and then when they do get to open shots, you know they have so much confidence now they knock it down. Mm-hmm. I mean, they were knocking it. I mean, you got a, um, I forgot the guy with the um, long uh, dreads. Um, they came in for the Lakers. Um, I want to, Paris? Torian Prince? Prince, Prince, Prince that's it, Prince. Yeah. Torian Prince. Came in, balled down. He did. Knocked down a couple of shots. You know, did, so that's why Russell I think. Russell did his thing. Well, of course. Yeah, he going to do. Yep. Well, so, but if you bet on uh, LeBron's of the j- prop last night, he didn't get. He only got well, twenty three. What was it, like twenty eight? I can't remember. Uh, I mean, I, I just heard. <laughs> LeBron came up one short. <laughs> it's people it's, mad. It's people mad about that. So did I. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to the short list, Pam. Yeah. Welcome to the short list. But yeah, I think um, I don't know. But let's hear from Darwin Ham, head coach for the Los Angeles Lakers, as he talks about preparing to play the Denver Nuggets. Mm. Extremely, it's an opportunity, and like I said, man, it's back to zero on zero. Obviously, they've had a ton of success against our ball club, but there's always a new day. And you know, my my staff and I have already been putting the groundwork together for that game plan, and we'll get together tomorrow. Other guys, the team have a day off, but we'll start to work the process of building out the game plan and go up there and give it our best shot. That's all we can do. We feel comfortable, though. We like where we are. We like where the spirit of our group is. Everybody's chipping in, pitching in, excited about this challenge and this opportunity and respect to them. They'll have a little ball club. It's the reason why they're defending champs. We, we like our chances. They haven't beat the Nuggets. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> they haven't beat them since 2022. Yeah, but you like, like your I chances. Like, <laughs> like, 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 seriously, I think they've lost like the last eight. Yes. The last eight times oh, they God. faced one another. I, mean, I think they've lost like the last eight. But they've been working on a plan. See the problem they have is they they think they can. It looks like you can win, mm. but the fact that the Nuggets know they're playing LeBron, they all play at a different level. Mm-hmm. The Pelicans are the only team that I've seen when they play the Lakers don't step their game up. You know, collectively, right? Like one player, you know, go out, but like Ingram never does anything. I mean, they never do anything. 
No, I mean they just they just freeze. Whenever they play the Lakers or they play LeBron, they just kind of like like deer in the headlights. Like freeze. <laughs> <laughs> it's like man, take that man picture off your wall. Starstruck. You, hey, look, look, you a ball player too. Figure it out. You're in the same league. You're in the same league. <laughs> <laughs> like you have literally been playing him for like the last three years, and you and we walk in, you still go, wow, man, that's Bron, that's Bron, man. I mean, that's that's how they play. That's yeah, how exactly. That's how fr- if that's how frustrating it is to watch the, watch them play, because you think to yourself like, okay, this is pretty good talent on the floor. You got you know Trey, you got Zion, you got this guy, then you got you know, um, see now, I got. How much is CJ McCullough making? Anybody know? Does anybody know I how CJ McCullough make? I could look it up real quick. Cause I want it back. <laughs> I want, I'm like for real. I want it back. There was zero leadership. No vocal. Nobody's being vocal last night. Nobody. No one's talking. No one. To, they're not doing anything. And I'm just like, what are y'all doing? Like nobody wanted. Nobody really wanted to play. You know, it, it it was really it was really disappointing from a professional NBA franchise with a chance Ooh. to get into the playoffs. So what did CJ make? Sixty four million. <laughs> <laughs> he signed that in uh, twenty twenty two, two years. Uh, they got the extension through so, to twenty twenty six. Sixty four million contract extension. So so the guy we were watching last night mm-hmm. makes thirty four million dollars. He made thirty four million dollars. In this season, yes, to do what he did last night it was thirty-four million divided by eighty-two games. I, want my money I don't back. know, but the math. Ain't I want math. my. I want That's my money. All I, know. I want my money back from last night. <laughs> I'm serious. I want my money back from last night. Don't you think so, Pam? I agree, but I mean, you know, everybody has a bad game. Yeah, bad game. He didn't show. He didn't show, Pam. You got to show it for the big games. All right, he owes me forty-two thousand dollars. I want it back. Right now. I need a forty two I want all of it back. Forty two K. Mm-hmm. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Like, did, were you impressed? How many points did you have last no, night? No, I was not impressed. Four? Let's see. Four. <laughs> I mean I, I think he made a shot toward the end when uh, Zion was out. Like he had no choice, like it was an accident. Right. Like it went in by accident. He had nine. Woo, you were close. <laughs> <laughs> Nine points. Yeah, nine points. Yes. Nine points, huh? So, so we just pay him five thousand dollars a shot. Pretty much. I mean, the whole team. I mean, Zion had forty, but everybody else. No 10, 11, five. 12, 4, 9. Mm. That's and, it. And then Brandon start, Brandon Ingram started started out playing. Then he yeah he came back to Kinston. He had eleven. Yeah, you know, he started out. You know, I was like, okay, this is gonna mm-hmm. be nice. Yeah, and then he stood out there the most time trying to figure out how to pass and look like magic. I think he was coming back from injury, though. What injury was it, though, by the way? A uh, knee injury. Mm. So, so I think I think they're, like, ramping him up, kind of. Mm. I does think he, he was on a minutes restriction, possibly. Does he know he's supposed to be ramping up? <laughs> I mean, I guess they got the seventh seed for a reason. They have another opportunity uh, <laughs> on Friday, I think, or Thursday. But if you say, if you look at it, he did his part. He came out. Gave him a quick spurt, mm-hmm. quick run. He said, "All right, Cole, that's all I got right now." He said that, which is cool. Yeah, if that's you know, if, if that's all he can do right now. But he, what about the rest? But the rest of them, <laughs> they don't have any excuse. It was horrible. It was horrible, man. We got so many I mean, things look to talk at this, about. Their stats. 